announced a $10 million renovation plan coming to their housing center. And today we take a look at the Damiano Center and how they've been preparing to house Chum residents while they renovate in 2025. Northern News Now's Ryan Hayes caught up with the executive director of the Damiano Center to see what these changes will look like. Chum is expanding. The center will be starting a massive renovation in 2025, but this renovation brings up an important question. Where will its residents go? That's where the Damiano Center comes in. They're creating a 13,000 foot housing shelter on their third floor, which will accommodate Chum residents while they renovate. St. Louis County Commissioner Ashley Grimm says the impact of this will be long lasting. So in the short run, this is going to keep a lot of people from becoming unsheltered homeless in Duluth. And then in the long run, after Chum is reopened, it can be used for housing. It can be used for what the community needs and what they identify. Upgrades will ensure the third floor is up to code for living there with proper heating, electricity and plumbing. Executive Director of the Damiano Center, Seth Currier, is very excited about the impact this project and others will have on addressing housing insecurity in the city. I think we can really change the face of homelessness, what homelessness actually looks like and housing insecurity looks like in our community in the next three years. They have already received $1.4 million in funding from the county and are hoping to receive another $1 million from the city of Duluth. Grimm says that the Damiano Center is a perfect place to house people during Chum's renovation because of all the services it provides, like access to clothing and childcare. It really is a hub of services, and so I think this will be a really good spot to house people. The Damiano Center is hoping to have this project fully funded by the end of the month. In Duluth, Ryan Hayes, Northern News Now. Courier thanks the county for the funding and the city of Duluth and their continued collaboration. If you want to learn more about the renovations to Chum and what's going on at the Damiano Center, you can check out our website.